Hey guys, this is your Tusted Weather Forecast, and today we're going to be talking about my finalized winter 2020 to 2021 weather forecast. Before we get into this, I'd like to ask you to subscribe. About 75% of you who watch my videos are not subscribed, so please click the subscribe button if you like weather-related content, hit the notification bell if you do not want to miss a single upload. Also, share this with friends and family and like the video to get this out to as many people as possible. Let's get right into this. This is my temperature outlook for winter 2020 to 2021 finalized. Things have changed significantly since my last winter outlook and things are looking less favorable for a super active winter. The lightest blue you see there going from Idaho into Michigan and even portions of New York are slightly below average temperatures expected where you could see one to three degrees below average in terms of temperature this winter. The cyan color going from the northwest into the upper Great Lakes, Wisconsin and Michigan are moderately below average temperatures where you could see a couple to a few degrees below average in terms of temperatures this winter. And the darkest blue you see there in Montana and North Dakota are significantly below average temperatures where you could see uh, many degrees below average in terms of temperatures, potentially up to 10 degrees below average. Going to the south, the yellow you see there going from Northern California into Arkansas into portions of the East Coast in Virginia and North Carolina are slightly above average temperatures this winter, where you could see one to three degrees above average in terms of temperature. And the orange you see there going from California into the Gulf Coast is moderately above average temperatures, where you could see a couple to a few degrees above average. And the red you see there in Southern California and Western Arizona is significantly above average temperatures, where you could see many degrees above average, potentially up to 10 degrees this winter. Moving on to precipitation, this is my precipitation forecast for winter 2020 to 2021. And the lightest green you see there going from the northwest into portions of New York and as far south as Missouri is slightly above average precipitation, where you could see a couple half inches above average in terms of precipitation. And the darkest green you see there in the northwest and portions of the Great Lakes is moderately above average precipitation, where you could see a couple to a few inches above average in terms of precipitation. Precipitation includes rain and snow, both of those. The lightest brown you see there going from northern California into the Gulf and southeast is slightly below average precipitation, where you could see a couple half inches below average in terms of precipitation. And the darkest brown you see there all across the southwest is moderately below average precipitation, where you could see a couple inches, whole inches below average in terms of precipitation this winter. Moving on to my overall winter forecast. In the northwest, in Washington, Oregon, Idaho, it will be cooler and more stormy this winter. And the red in California, Nevada, Arizona, it will be hot at times. The yellow in Utah, Colorado, Wyoming, it will be flip-flop. So it will be average, above average, below average, going back and forth in that flip-flop pattern. And the brown in Texas and New Mexico, it will be very dry this winter, more dry than usual. And the white in north central United States, it will be snowy this winter, pretty close to average. And the pink you see there going from Kansas, Nebraska into Minnesota, there will be multiple Arctic blasts where temperatures will plummet. And the darkest blue in Illinois, Missouri, the Midwest area, there will be lots of snow chances this winter. And the yellow in the Gulf, it will be near average in terms of this winter and the cyan color in the upper Great Lakes and most of Michigan. Lake effect snow will be likely in winter, potentially above average lake effect snow too. And in the pink in the southeast and the Carolina areas, there will be multiple ice chances this winter. And per usual, per any winter, there will be plenty of nor'easters that hit the northeast in New England this winter and drop lots of snow. Question of the day for this video is what are you most looking forward to this winter? Whether that be the Christmas holiday, the snow, anything that you are looking forward to this winter. Comment your answers below and I will come over. That's your trusted weather forecast for this upcoming finalized winter 2020 to 2021 weather forecast. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment if you want. Goodbye.